what's up guys so this is a remake of this Citra network airdrop you know the whole thing the whole transaction that you need to complete right here so i don't really have much to say in this video let's just jump right into the airdrop so you, i can show you how you, you can complete all the transactions right here so first off connect your wallet right here so we're just gonna go ahead and connect our wallet right here and yeah and so you can see right here my wallet is connected right now so all i'm i need to do is just for me to go ahead and generate a taproot address so i'm just gonna go ahead and click on generate new and your private key and every other thing are here right now so all you need to do is just for you to go ahead and download it so i'm just gonna go ahead and download it right now and it's on my laptop already so what i need to do once you are done with generating the taproot address next thing is for you to go ahead and complete the transactions that are here so i'm just gonna go ahead and claim for search right now so uh this is my wallet this is my wallet address all i need to do is just for me to go ahead just refresh this right here and then uh yeah just accept right here and then click on login to use the faucet so uh, i actually need to log in and then i could actually use my discord or my twitter but i, I, I don't know maybe use twitter right here so we could actually connect our twitter account so we can be able to go ahead and use the faucet so click on authorize right here and then we'll go back okay so you can see right here you can see right here my wallet is connected and i've actually you know signed in right here all i need to do is just for me to verify that i'm a human and then click on request for sets right here and you will receive your faucet in your wallet so uh yeah says the faucet request was successful so i should see my citria faucet my cbtc right here on my wallet anytime soon so once you do that next thing is for you to go ahead and swap what you've actually claimed so we'll have about 0 0.001 right here so what i need to do is just for me to type the amount that i want to swap for any of this token right here so you could actually click right here and you know choose a list and or you could actually go ahead and get a list of you know the token that you want to swap to so i could actually go ahead and click on open specification right here uh not this one right here this token list right here so i can be able to see uh, all the lists that are here so you could actually copy the contract address of all this one so i mostly go to coin gecko so i can get the contract address of all the tokens that are there so depending on which one you want to swap to you could actually swap to uh maybe any of these ones that are here so uh, i mostly use like one inch or you could actually swap to anything just it's anything right here and then you come right here and copy the contract address that you want to swap to and then we are just going to go ahead and click on choose list right here and then you paste the contract address and then you click on uh select right here you could actually select uh usdc or anyone that you want so i'm just showing you in case that one doesn't work you could actually use the other the, the other alternative but since usdc is here we could actually paste this one uh it's not here uh not here so we're just gonna delete it and then go ahead and use usdc right here so i'm just gonna go ahead and use usdc swap from cbtc to usdc right here so i'm just gonna put 0 0.001 or 2 right here anyone that you want to swap is up to you and then i'm just gonna select it and then click on swap and then click on confirm right here and then you go to your wallet and sign the transaction click on confirm right here and the transaction will be submitted or once it says transaction submitted all you need to do is just for you to wait for that close you can see right here two transactions have been confirmed and okay this one is currently on pending so okay so the swap was successful you can see right here swap of 0, 0.00 cbtc to 0 0.03 usdc right here so the essence of this is for you to carry out as many transactions as possible so there is no there is no reason why you should be putting like a large amount of money right here all you need to do is just for you to put you can see right here i swapped 0 0.0 zero three usdc so it's pretty much low so the, the 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 what you need to do is just for you to have as many transactions as possible and just reduce the amount that you swap right here so it will be easier and pretty much simpler for you and i think that's pretty much explains it all for any airdrop for any testnet that you're currently once it involves bridging or you know even staking as well what you need to do is for you to come to perform as much transactions as possible so most of the times i do pay, i do do i do do this like 10 to 20 or even 30 times depending on the amount 
that I allocate for this particular airdrop for that day. So all you need to do is just for you to do it as much as possible. So you can be able to qualify for a lot of things right here. And you, now you can also go ahead and add to pools right here. And uh, all you need to do is just for you to click on add liquidity. And you, what you need to do, what you're actually doing is you are adding CBTC to maybe USDC or anyone that you want right here. USDC right here. I'm just going to go ahead and paste the same amount and click on supply right here. And then you click on confirm. And then you go to your wallet and, and you know, confirm the transaction. So it's not really that hard. Just confirm right here. And then you close right here. And it should confirm just like the other one in a few minutes. And once you're done with that, all you need to do is just for you to also go ahead and deploy ERC20 token right here. So I'm just going to go ahead and connect my wallet right here. And yeah. Yeah, connect wallet right here. And you can see right here, my wallet is only also connected. So you need to choose a name for the token that you want to deploy right here. So maybe I should name it uh, uh, just uh, uh, Papa right here. <laughs> So I'm just going to name it your papa right here and choose the token symbol, maybe YP right here. And then you can also choose the initial supply right here, maybe two, one, two, three, four, five. I don't know, maybe two million or two thousand or even two, depending on the token supply that you want to have. So you could actually choose yes or no right here, but I will always leave it at yes and click on deploy right here and it will start the deployment right here. All you need to do is just for you to go ahead and sign on your wallet. Once you have CBTC on your wallet to confirm the transaction, it will definitely go through. So uh, deployment was successful. This is your contract address, pretty much simple and straightforward. And once you're done with that, you can also come right here and complete this uh, layer three task that is also here. So uh, all you need to do is just for you to complete it. I think you need some about uh, L3 is about, yeah, you need L3 for you to be able to claim these cubes and SP right here, but it's pretty much important. Please go ahead and complete all the tasks that I have just shown you right here. I've shown you how to do it. The boy is now in your court. Go ahead and complete all this transaction right here. So you can position yourself well for the airdrop. And before I go ahead, before I go on, before I, <laughs> before I go, I would like to actually show you this document right here. So a lot of you guys has been asking questions how do i keep tab with all these airdrops that we're currently farming right here it's pretty much simple i have a document where i used to do my daily check-in and daily airdrop uh, testnet and all of them i just go through all of them and complete all the transactions right here and i've actually made it public all you need to do is just for you to go ahead and click on it if it's not working you could actually check the profile of this channel i will act i will try my possible best to add it right there so you could actually click on it and then you come right here and use it and complete all these transactions right all these test nets that are here so these are all the test nets that we are currently farming right here and you can also go to daily check-in and complete all these ones that are here so that's pretty much it there is nothing really hard about keeping tab with all these airdrops that, that are currently here so i think we are farming our over 30 airdrops right here on this channel so if you've not joined all of them join all of them so you can be able to farm all these airdrop at once simple and easy so that's pretty much it for this video. See you guys on the next one.